been a minute um that's my bad <laughs> i moved to a new city and also i basically started a new job because what i'm doing now in person is basically completely different from what i've been doing this whole summer so that's why i've been kind of a wall for about a month and a half a month i don't actually know how long um yeah background for this video we woke up at 5 30 a.m and we started driving at about 6 30 i think yeah we wound up somehow salem massachusetts i go to school in boston so that's fun <laughs> so i hope you enjoy watching me unpack and move up to boston again for the third time now <laughs> i'm a third year now y'all chapter one i go cruising with explosives why am i so afraid just to say a hello Right now it's about like 8.30 or something and my mom and my sister are driving up with me um, and they just stopped in a Starbucks to go to the bathroom. We've been driving for about two hours. We just got in New Jersey. Yeah, we've been listening to Percy Jackson and the Last Olympian audiobook. It's still a banger. Oh yeah, I also got my COVID results. Uh, they came back negative because Massachusetts requires that you test negative 72 hours before, or no, that you get a test 72 hours before you travel and that it obviously should be negative. Anyway, we're traveling up with all my stuff. So this is mostly kitchen stuff and like pots and pans. I covered it up with a sweater, my mom's overnight bag. This is more food um sheets and also this is my overnight bag so then we don't have to take out all of my luggage refrigerated goods and these two suitcases are clothes and that's a board game so this is a lot of stuff but also at the same time definitely not nearly as much as when i was moving in freshman year um yeah it's been a long time and i've been thinking Give you a call to shoot the shit and fill you in, we're reminiscing Yeah <laughs> All the dumb things we did when we were only little children Up in the hills smoking cigarillos waiting on a vision Of what our life would be like If we were dreaming and together we were wishing Cause now I'm living in the city that. and you're back home <laughs> And all I'm doing basically unpack the kitchen stuff that I have so now I'm going to be getting started on my bedroom but the problem is that half of the stuff from my bedroom is still in storage and that doesn't come until tomorrow so I'm gonna chip away at it and then meet my sister and my mom for dinner <sighs> today's been busy day I can't believe that we actually went to Salem Massachusetts today <laughs> just because my time slot wasn't early enough in the day it was at like 2 30 to move in room currently that i'm unpacking this closet has no storage right now so i'm gonna have to add that in and this underbed storage is pretty small <laughs> so i don't know if i'll be able to fit all of my clothes but yeah i'm gonna just put some sheets on the bed and then see what i can do from there
day three of moving and my storage came. All of these clothes are from one of the storage boxes and I have one, two, three, four, two more and a shelving unit. And I have work. Exactly. I think I struck.